So, I uh, thought I'd make this video about uh, these older Cisco 1700 series uh, routers. Now, I, um, I was asked to fix one, and by fix it, I mean somebody erased the iOS. Now, I had a couple uh, sitting around that I was able to pull an iOS from. But if you don't have the ability to download uh, from Cisco, you're not going to be able to get an iOS for it uh, unless you find one that's not um, genuine from Cisco. And I wouldn't recommend that. But uh, anyway, we're not going to go into that. Uh, what I'm going to tell you is, is there's supposed to be a way to use a TFTP server uh, in the Raman, you use through uh, set commands and stuff. I spent about an hour. I was going to make a video on that if it worked, but it didn't work. Now, I've seen it done, and I've heard about it being done, but I decided to use the old way, which is Xmodem. And the Xmodem command is really not that bad. It, what takes what, What's bad about Xmodem is, is it's a bit level transfer, so it's one bit at a time. So it's going to be really slow. Now on a device like this, the image is only like 3 megs. So it's not going to take 8 hours. It's probably going to take 2. But it's not going to take all day. As uh, if you were trying to reload um, something without a uh, compact flash. Uh, that's uh, all internal memory like these. Uh, say a switch. Like uh, the 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 twenty six um, is it the twenty six sixty? Yeah, those are good. Those are good land based switches. Uh, the the new image that you could put on there uh, is sixteen megs, and if you have to transfer that, it's going to take uh, quite a bit of time. Uh, fortunately, I actually up uploaded um, or updated a bunch of those a couple years ago. And on all of them except one, there was plenty of room in the memory to um, TFTP server uh, another image right into it. There was only one where I got shaky, and what I did was is I just erased the current uh, the current flash, everything in the flash, the configuration file, the uh, um, all the relevant information it was a lab it was a lab switch anyways for lab students and what I did was I just erased the current iOS and while it was still running I uh, put the new uh, iOS in and I still had TFTP ability because the iOS was still running in RAM so I didn't reboot after deleting the iOS I just started the TFTP server got the image in and once it was in I just rebooted and it booted to the new uh, image that I put in there since there wasn't a list to choose from now on this router uh, I'm about 17 percent done and it's been uh, 11 minutes I started it 11 minutes ago so what I ended up doing like I was going to tell you the commands um, I'll swing it around here uh, Where's the command? Okay, the command is just simply X modem uh, destination file name, and I mean the whole thing. You gotta put flash uh, colon forward slash, uh, then the whole image name. Let's swing this around here. Well, if you can make that out. Okay. Probably not, but oh, we'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. Um, and then you have to set up your transfer. Now I use uh, TerraTerm, which has the ability to do X modem uh, transfers. If you're using something else that doesn't, uh, I'm not sure. There's a few other programs. Uh, Secure CRT uh, may have the ability. I've heard it's really a good one. I haven't checked that one out yet. I was going to check out Secure CRT as a uh, terminal, terminal emulator. Um, I was, I don't like uh, putty. I don't know why I don't like putty. I just, I don't use it. I, I know how to use it. I just always go to TerraTerm uh, when it comes to terminal uh, emulation. Uh, and 
like I said, it's it's working. It's sending the file, uh, and uh, I'll I'll come back in. Uh, I'm gonna pause this, and I'll come back in when it's finished. Or uh, I might just do a separate uh, segment on how it how it went. Uh, but we're gonna see. It's it's been uh, uh, 13 minutes now. We're at 20 percent, so it's gonna take some time to send this file over uh, through the console. Uh, wish I was able to get the uh, the the Rahman set properly to do the TFTP server. It just kept refusing my default gateway and I don't know why. I even tried making the TFTP server the default gateway and it just said it wasn't a legitimate gateway which doesn't make any sense. I don't know why. I'm not digging into that for free work. Uh, I'm, I'm just trying to get it get it up and running. Uh, it's just a favor for a buddy anyway, so I don't know what he's going to do with this old equipment. He says he has a purpose for it, and uh, I told him I would put the image back on it, and lucky I had one to copy an image from, because I don't have that image, and I don't have the ability to download uh, new images. I wish I did, but I don't. Uh, anyway, I will... Um, uh, get back to you on this uh, see how it goes in an hour or two and uh, we'll, we'll go from there